Okay. Hey there everyone, Hitesh here back again with another video. In this video, we are not talking about tech, but it's related to the tech, but it's more over how to learn tech and how to manage your time. This is going to be a special video which has been requested for a long time on my channel that how do a lot of stuff so easily. In case you don't know that I do a lot of stuff managing my clients, uh, managing my own apps and websites as well as teaching things on boot camps as well as on videos, having offline boot camps, traveling to the rare part of the world like Switzerland or Egypt and a lot of other places as well or riding my Harley Davidson from Jaipur to Goa. So I do a lot of these kinds of stuff every single year and a lot of people ask me how am I able to do so? How do I manage all these times? And uh, how do I actually do it? So in this video we are going to talk all about it coming up in this video. In this channel, we talk about programming, web apps, mobile apps, and pretty much everything related to tech, as well as sometimes some tips about tech just like this one. So in case you are new here, please do consider subscribing. Now moving on to the point that how am I able to do all these things? Now at one point of time, I was just like you guys, just like a big nurse, and I was completely happy. Now also, I would, I would like to just uh, kind of accept this, yes, at one point of time, Finishing up my favorite season just in one night was the most prioritized thing for me and I was completely happy with that. But eventually I realized that this is not going to work. Watching all those seasons, all those movies just lying around at my bed is not going to work. If I have to do something meaningful with my life, I have to work on it and I have to start a little bit hard. Next day, the entire hard disk was formatted. None of the season, none of the episodes, none of the movies that I really do like to have collections even. I stopped doing that. Throw off all of my DVDs and everything, all subscription plan, cancelled them all and started working. Now again, I, I worked really hard on that and one point of time I was a great penetration tester. I still do that, uh, but I was working fine as a penetration tester. Having a good job, nice salary, all of my travel in the India, air tickets and hotels were covered up by the company. I was getting a lot of invites from the universities. I have traveled to a lot of them and life was good. But then I realized I can do a little bit better because I read a quote. I really forget where I read that. I really, really uh, am sad that I cannot actually give credit to the person who wrote, who wrote that quote that no matter what happens, the Bill Gates or the Mark Zuckerberg all of them have 24 hours in life and so does you. If you want to utilize your time, if you want to utilize your life, you have to work a little bit harder. Try to squeeze out the time a little bit from your sleep, little bit from the movie time, little bit from the family time and obviously you can get success. Now this was the quote of saying that hey everybody in the life has 24 hours and some people utilize it, some don't. Really stuck it to me. And I really wanted to make sure that now I am going to do a lot of things. I learned about the time management and this is my tip to everybody. Whether you are learning programming, maybe guitar, maybe learning bike riding or whatever you are doing, time management is the most essential skill. Make sure that you make a proper plan of your entire day, a month and a complete year if possible. I know at the initial stage year planning is not at all a good idea but at least make a plan of entire day or entire week. You should have goals in my mind that by the end of the day, what will I accomplish? What is the new thing that I'm going to learn? By the end of this month, I should analyze my things that what I have learned, is there a difference in my educational level from the last month to this month and what I have actually created. Now the self enhancement or self assessment uh, will help you to understand that what you have gained and what you have lost. Time is the most beautiful thing. It's the most valuable thing. Money, you can earn it at any point of time, but time, once it's gone, it's gone. So make sure that you create entire time. Now, I, in my phone, I use a lot of productivity hacks, like one most important thing is my to-do list. I, I have just created my own personal to-do list, my own personal app in my phone, 
Uh, it's not there on the App Store, but it's nothing extraordinary. You can find hundreds of to-do apps. It just lists down what the things I have to do today. Now, I am never able to finish uh, all those apps. I just try to keep a list of them. How, how many I can check them out in a day, that's my goal. And I keep adding a lot of them. And I try to make sure that by end of the week on Saturdays, it's completely off. I should be free. Now, this is one tip that I follow up. But apart from that, that will help you to make sure that you are the best in the time management is going to be priorities. And nobody can tell you what the priorities are. Sometimes you give priorities more to the friends than the work, sometimes more to the work than friends. You have to be your own judge what you are going to do. Sometimes, sometimes people will say, hey, family is the most important thing, friends are the most important things. I'm not here to argue or discuss about that. All I'm here is to say that it's the priorities and you have to set it on your own way. Sometimes, it's not the priority to go ahead and watch the latest movies. Sometimes it's more priority uh, being given to the project that you are working or the thing that you are learning. And make sure you reward yourself as well because this is again key important aspect. If you will not reward yourself, then it's going to be a little boring. So make sure when you, when you are taking a course, making a project or doing learning anything, once you have done that, make sure that you, you kind of uh, give a simple party to yourself go ahead watch a movie buy your gadget that you are looking up for just treat yourself it's the important aspect now these are the few things that i have shared with you so let's just summarize them as well and i'll make sure that i come up with these videos later on as well first of all everybody in this world has just 24 hours in life one day 24 hour that's it whether he's a bill gates mark zuckerberg or you or me you can do a lot more than what you are doing our human body is capable of handling a lot more than what you are doing so far right now. Point number two that I really always emphasize, have a schedule. If you are not going to be scheduled, it's the you who is going to be feeling bad about it. So make a schedule. What you're gonna do today, what you're gonna do in the end of the week. Make sure that everything is planned out. Keep your everything in a to-do list. What I need to do today. Make sure if you are in a course or somewhere, I have to watch five videos today. That is going to be priority. Make sure you check mark every single day for it. I have to learn Java or Kotlin or Swift, whatever you are learning. Make sure you keep in mind that by the end of three weeks, I will accomplish that. No matter what happens, travel plans, movie plans, that will come up later on, but I'm gonna stick to that. That's point number two. So everything you should keep that into an arrangement point number three is setting up the priorities which is super important and uh, i'm no judge here to say that hey don't go with the friends just keep on working or keep on working don't go with the friends whatever you like it's the you who is going to decide what is your priority and trust me once you have started to working a little bit on your time management skill and self-assessment that hey uh, what i have accomplished in the end of the day or maybe end of the week life is going to be changed thoroughly. Eventually, you will get more time and you will be able to treat yourself a little bit more better. Like for example, when I'll be accomplishing this Android development course, I'll be treating myself by some travel or maybe some buying a new gadget or something. I haven't planned that out yet, but yes, that is important. Okay, I know this was not the conventional video which we do at this channel, the tech videos or something, but again, to learn anything, Learning is the same process and to learn tech or maybe non-tech things, time management is the most essential and beautiful thing, okay? So keep in mind that time is something that you cannot get back. Money, you can, but time, you cannot. So treat your time as the most valuable thing. So in case you're watching your favorite series or movies, you can get back to that or you can start something that you really wanted to learn so far.